Who have we prepared? Huh? So, yeah, this is uh, uh, incredibly high speed, but uh, <laughs> very <laughs> too, informal. Too much, uh, yeah. <laughs> I, I, you know, I we don't have democracy in all the all the world, so I easily understand. But usually, like uh, uh, East Europe or Latin America, it, they they are not. If you are not familiar with it, very difficult to understand. Right, <laughs> right, 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 right. Yeah. So we we we've been we've been discussing these uh, these topics uh, quite in depth. Uh, but uh, yeah. So 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 basically. The Cold War um, started already during World War Two. I think uh, he gave a, a number of options. I think it already started during World War Two, um, where basically the West needed Russia and 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 the, so the Soviet Union, and the Soviet Union needed the Allied forces uh, because they had a, a common enemy, but they were certainly not friends. Mm. Um, uh, Stalin. Where we may we may we may accuse the uh, Soviet Union of starting it by st by uh, by uh, signing the, the the peace treaty with the, with the, with Germany, but that was short lived, and and Stalin was was then pissed off that Western nations did not come to uh, form a front on 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 the Western uh, Western side. Uh, so that that was the beginning of the end, and and even as World War Two played out. Uh, the Soviet Union actually they had much more casualties than uh, than than uh, the Allied forces. Uh, uh, I believe about 20 million uh, Russian people died uh, uh, because of World War Two because of famine and, and, and uh, uh, just by being killed. So that that was enormous, um, enormous large number. So uh, Russia, the uh, Soviet Union paid uh, very high sacrifices. Um, and it was it was very clear that, that there was a race going on. Like, okay, how are we going to uh, towards the end of the war? Maybe it was uh, one one objective was to to eradicate to stop Germany, but the other one was to to, to quickly uh, catch as much uh, land as possible. Um, one of the reasons why probably the United States actually uh, wanted to end the war in. Uh, uh, with Japan and, and, and through atomic bombs was maybe because they wanted to be first uh, and, and avoid uh, Soviet Union for taking control over, over Japan. Um, same thing happened in, uh, in, uh, in Europe. In Europe actually, the, this, this is a history that's kind of relatable for me because I, I lived through part of it. Uh, so I, I can very clearly remember um, uh, the, the, the division between East and West, and, and as he said towards the end of the movie, I, I, I can really also uh, feel like when I was when I was a kid, then then this history, that situation of of uh, communism versus capitalism was was very real. Um, it was always assumed that if this was going to get hot, um, that it would get hot in Germany, Netherlands, uh, and and. The, the nuclear war would not take place uh, in in Soviet Union or in uh, the United States, but actually in Europe. That's where uh, where, where where it would take place, and it was um, yeah. We were very worried, very worried uh, about it. But there were uh, uh, within Europe there were strong divisions between uh, people who were very much in favor of this system of mad of, of mutually de mutual deterrence. Um, where uh, they wanted to uh... oh shit my laundry is hanging out <laughs> it's raining <laughs> okay uh, so there was this system of, of, uh, of um, um, mutual deterrence where, where both sides could, could destroy each other uh, uh, many times around uh, but uh, uh, did not. Um, uh, can I can I have uh, one second? I w I'm going to <laughs> I'm going to uh, Go take yeah, in my I'm laundry. One second.
By the way, uh, the Malaysia and uh, Penang is the same uh, time zone, right? Two hours uh, earlier yes. than Japan, right? Two hours, two hours behind. Uh, but Malaysia, I think, is one hour. One hour. Uh, <coughs> one hour till Japan. So Takashi is the two hour behind and uh, mm -hmm. then I'm one hour behind. Okay. It's it's in <laughs> it's falling down like there's no tomorrow. Oh <laughs> what are you doing? Yeah. Uh, there's, uh, I had my laundry out. And it's it's raining very hard here. What? It's raining very hard here, no? Can you hear me? What was that? Can you hear me? Yeah, 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 yeah. I, I can hear oh, you. Okay. Sorry by about the way, that. by the way, you you are in your house, right? Right. What do you mean raining? Raining? What do you say? It's raining very, very hard. What's hard? Raining. What do you mean, raining? Raining? But I mean raining. It's, ra it's raining very, very hard. Oh, you're go talking, go going back to Soviet? <laughs> no, no, <laughs> no, 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 no. Okay, I thought you're yeah. talking about the laundry. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. No, no, no. We talk about laundry. So it's it's raining very hard. So I needed to to take in the the, the laundry. Oh, okay. Now you uh, settle. Sorry. You settle. Yeah, I'm settled. Okay. I'm Go ahead. Um, okay. So um, so so the the, the the impact of the so the, the start of the Cold War it started. Actually, before um, uh, during World War Two, um, then after that there was this 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 period where the United States uh, uh, grew its influence by establishing NATO by uh, giving out the martial aid um, that actually um, was very successful in uh, in uh, revitalizing the. Uh, uh, European, the West European nations, uh, Japan, um, was uh, uh, a very good, bold, bold and good economic move that mm. that benefited us uh, and the United States um, because they actually um, uh, also uh, got a lot of influence through that, and uh, a lot of our spending also um, went to the United States. So it also stimulated the uh, the American economy. So a very successful plan. And one uh, reason, one ground, uh, one major explanation for the end of the Cold War was actually that um, uh, we were just much more economically successful than uh, than the uh, uh, than Eastern Europe. Uh, in, in, in so the Soviet Union had to support many countries who were dysfunctioning um, because uh, there were not the, the right incentives. Uh, he, he uses the example of silly putty. Uh, I don't know if you know silly putty, but, but I do. It's a it's a very stupid, slimy stuff uh, that uh, uh, it doesn't do anything. It's just uh, uh, you can just run it through your fingers, and it feels a bit strange. It looks a little bit like uh, uh, well, like what comes what comes from your nose, and uh, um, it's. It, it, those those kinds of like this kinds of consumer consumerism um, was uh, was one of the drivers uh, behind this. The, 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 the well basically the West winning over uh, East size the capitalism uh, winning from communism.
はい皆さんこんにちは運野です今日はですね運野塾のあの研修のプログラムをご紹介したいと思いますでまあこういうふうなホームページありますけれどもあのぜひですねあの一度中身をご覧になっていただきたいと思いますあ今日はブーキューブさんのスタジオに来てまあこの収録をしておりますので、えー、中身はこういうふうになってて今最近ホットなねグローバルリーダーの定義など書いておりますで特にあの県団連が作成しましたまあ、留学すればあの英語ができて専門性を持つというだけではですね、えー、グローバルリーダーにならないとここに書いてありますようにですね、えー、仕事ができる専門性を持つ英語ができるだけじゃなくてですね私どもの塾ではあリベラルアースということそれからあもう一つは孫子の兵をさらにはですね、えー、日本の歴史というものを合わせて教えることによって皆さんが海外の欧米の方々ともしくは華僑圏の方々と正々堂々と渡り合えるような人物を育成しようというふうなことを考えていますここにあの次のスライドが出ておりますけれどもここにあの書いてありますのですねさらに、えー、私どもの運動塾の中身につきましてはですね欧米の資料しか使っておりませんまた実際に運動塾は英語ではやっておりますので、まあ、英語の講師がこう話しておりますけど学習はですね日本の歴史をまだ教えてますので、各週の午後はですね、日本のプログラムをしております。で以前はこれ、有料だったんで、今はですね、実際に会場費も取っていただいておりませんで、毎回5000円ということで、朝9時から午後5時までやっておりますので、ぜひ皆さんですね、ご検討の上、ご参加いただければと、英語のできない方もですね、各週の午後、こういうふうな検証をしておりますので、ぜひご参加いただければというふうに思っておりますので、よろししくお願いしますでここにあの、えー、さらにですねあのグループ討議とか実務の勘どころを教えるって書いてありますけど、まあ、実際には私があの10年ほどですね、えー、欧米の新聞とか雑誌等をですね集めてきたもともと英語のベースでございますのでそうしたものをですね50セッションのテーマに分けて資料を作成をしております、まあ、そういうことで、えー、世界のオペレーションもしくはカントリースクも含めてですねしかも世界のトップの方々に対してもいろいろな分析とか洞察をしてですね議論をしておりますそういったことも含めてですね今後ともよろしくお願いしたいと思います以上で私の挨拶を終えて終え,終えますが、まあ、今回のこのビデオの収録にあたってはですね V キブさんのスタジオをお借りしてですねお時間を頂戴して、まあ、このビデオを作成させていただきましたよろしくお願いしますどうもありがとうございました